guys, welcome back to another video. Today is a part one of my slime collection. Now this is going to be a two-parted video because I have a lot of slime, guys. So I figured I'm going to do the big containers and the small containers. And then I'll do, like, um, right now I'm doing the medium, big, and small. Not medium, just big and small. And then really small. Actually, I don't know. I mean, there's some little ones up there, so I'm just gonna do half of it, I guess you can say. So, let's get started. So, the first one that I have, I'm gonna start out with my rectangular containers. And I have a lot. I have like 50 some odd slimes, almost 60, I think. So, yeah. So, the first one I have. Is like a coffee color which is just brown and I figured it is so cool so it is that and it is kind of sticky so I don't want to really play with it but it is like a coffee color I will show you in just a minute so it's like a good coffee color and if you're wondering what those little black specks are, that is just part of the slime. So, this one's pretty good. So, I have coffee slime. And this one's sticky, so they're not all sticky. Some of them are, but not all of them. Then I have a s small slime, but it's in a large container because I don't have any small slimes. Small slime containers. But is this, like... <coughs> On camera, it looks really green, but off camera, it's like a peppermint green, like a mint color, I guess you can say. And I made a lot of new slimes, guys. So. Then I have a double container. So the first one I have is this purple bubbly one. It is foamy and frothy and really fun to play with. It's foamy. And it's fluffy slime. And this one is huge. This one's like my biggest slime that I have. And it's awesome. Like, I love playing with this one. And it's not that sticky. Which is very cool. Then I have this yellow. And it is part of the double container. It's like... And this one's not fluffy. It's just white with yellow dye and... My slime activator, that's it. Nothing else. And that's, again, in a double container. And I'm going to do a vlog right after this, so, yeah. Then I'm going to start off with my miniature ones and the small ones. So let's do Crazy Aaron's Putty. So I have Jungle, and this is by, by the Mix by Me Kit. And do you like, guys, do you guys like this natural lighting? There's no light on. So do you guys like the natural lighting? I mean, it is kind of cool. So this is jungle. This dark, dark, dark green. With no, like, shimmer eyes or nothing. Just glow in the dark. And it is actually scented. I made it scented. So, that's cool. Then I have ice. This is one of my favorite ones that I've got. It's kind of sticky because I accidentally added too much hand sanitizer. But it's so pretty, look at this. It's all shiny and stuff. So, yeah. And I actually started to vlog a little bit today. So that's going to be in there. And this is like Silly Putty. But better, so that's cool. <coughs> and I'm not sick no more, it's just I'm coughing. So, yeah. Then I have peppermint, and it's peppermint scented, too. It's like ice, but pink. Really pretty. And if you hear background noise, I'm sorry about that. Really nice. So, look out for part two soon. So, yep, just dropped it. Mm, I can't get the lid back on. Okay. 
Then I have a flyer, which is pumpkin scented. It doesn't really smell no more, but it is good. It looks pink on camera, but it's not. It's actually an orangey color. Maybe once I take it out, it'll be better. Yeah, I'm gonna turn it off. So as you can see, it is orange. Very nice orange color. And today is our first day of spring. Happy spring, guys. So, yeah. And I counted today. And I have 100 days till my birthday. Try and guess what my birthday is. That's the question for today's video. So guess what my when my birthday is. 100 days from now. So, yeah. Then I have Gloper. This is a purple one. Just like, um, fire, peppermint, and ice. It has shimmerizer and sparklizer. And they're all scented, a certain scent. So, yeah. So, that's it for Crazy Aaron's Putty. Well, they just fell over. Whatever. Okay. Then I'm going to go on to Little Putties. So, I have this Butter Slime. It's so soft. It's not like regular butter slime. It's just colored a buttered color. As you can see, it's like a butter, buttery color. Okay. Then I have, oh, this is a good one. Halloween, and it has pink, white, purple, and blue foam beads on the top. As you can see, like, right there. And guess what, guys? On the bottom is Halloween colored glitter. It's so pretty. The glitter doesn't fall out. The main color is green slime, which is so cool. The glitter does kind of stick on you, but it comes right off. But, yeah, it's pretty cool. This is a cool one. I really like this one. Okay, my slime is not wanting to stay up. So I have to get this glitter off of me, because... Yeah, and go check out people on Musical.ly. Follow me on Musical.ly, White Maisie, White and Maisie. Um, and click on my following thing and shout out to all those people. Then I have this green one. That's like, oh, tie-dye, I guess. But it's not picking up on camera, but there's like half light green and half dark green, which is cool. And my Loom Band slime is in this. So, and Caitlin Lambo, if you want to buy any of my slimes, Patricia Kershaw, if you want to buy any of my slimes, they are a dollar to, um, what's it called? Seven dollars. So. This one is seven dollars because it's clear slime with seashells and foam. So, this is called Seashore. It is with real seashells. And then it's in clear slime with foam beads. And then a tiny bit of dirt, which is cool. It's not like super dirty. It's like I got the dirt from like a craft store. So, yeah. So that one's pretty cool. Then I have liquid unicorn. So this is has the shiny paper in it. This is $4. And unfortunately, I'm not selling all my sl I, I'm not selling my slimes, only to the people I know, like Caitlin Lambo, Brian Redden Vlogs, people I know personally, Christopher's videos, Get Over Here Games, Gamer Games, Seth Extreme, and last but not least, J Justin Sharif Vlogs. Then I have a putty. Amazing putty. If I can open this. And this is magnetic, that's why. And I do have the magnet in here. That's why it's kind of hard to open. But I'm going to get this open. I'll be right back. Alright guys, so this is what it looks like. It does not come with a magnet. So I had to provide my own magnet. But that's fine, because I had tons. But it is magnetic. I won't show you on camera. But maybe it'll pick up. 
I don't know if you guys can see. But it is going to the magnet. I don't know if you guys can see or not. I don't know. Okay, so I have that one. That one's pretty cool. Gonna get two more of these. Not the magnetic. They have <coughs> different ones for different things. Then, here is the giant box of different cool slimes. I mean, I got a lot. So, the first one is this milk bone white. And this is just plain, nothing special in it. Then I have a creamy orange. I call this creamy orange. And all my whites are called milk bone for some reason. Some of them don't have slime names. Then I have red. This is just plain, I guess you can say. Okay. Then I have this pretty pink. And I don't want to pick it up because it is kind of sticky. Then I have this green. Beautiful green. Then I have a dark green. Kind of looks black on camera, but it's actually dark green. And a great big shout out to random person and um, who else? Ava S. Sarah Post and someone else. Um, she said that I hope you feel better. My last video, great big shout out to her. She deserves a giant shout. Out. Then I have this really breakable yellow. Yeah, yellow. Then I have bubblegum pink. Then I have cotton candy. Not cotton candy. Candy cane with um, candy cane erasers. As you can see. And none of these slimes in this box are for sale. So, yeah. Then I have another neon yellow. Then I have a fluffy light blue and it is fluffy it's crunchy too then i have this like purpley color and really pretty then i have a loom fan one now these ones are the cool ones these ones i am never selling or giving away or anything loom band slime with loom bands then i have two of these which i will show you both but I love this one. I made bead foam. And I'm just stretching it and it's crunching. Which is so cool. So I'm going to actually combine these two together. And this is how much I made in total because I made a lot. But I'm just going to stretch this guys. And look at how crunchy this is. Just by stretching. Not squeezing or anything. Just simply stretching. And it's like the stretchiest thing ever guys right I don't know if you guys heard it or not but it is pretty stretchy and crunchy and just fun just stretching it not even squeezing it very crunchy and listen so I do like this a lot I mean this is one of my favorite signs so Now I'm going to have to break this in half because it does not fit in the box together. So I'll break that in half. Okay. Oh no. Okay. Then, last but not least, still got an another. You can kind of see it up there. More slimes up there. This is another bead slime. I call this alphabet slime. And this is not stretchy. Well, it's stretchy. It's just not crunchy. When I stretch 